this is search man um this is my video remember i did a video on how to make quick beats on reason but uh i'm gonna go a whole another different route this is for those who got the swap magic but um have difficult using it or simply want to know how to use it those new swap magic users well i'm here to help you out now there's two things you got to be known for swap magic comes in two cds one's called a cd rom and one's called DVD ROM. One CD ROM is this one. If you can see it, I apologize for the camera. My damn camera fell yesterday when I was doing this. Uh, CD. And then the DVD ROM is right here. If you can see it, DVD. Yeah. See CD, DVD. Okay. Basically, what a DVD one does, it reads any PlayStation 2 games uh, that's over 700 megabytes, or MB for those who are short term. Uh, and the CD version is those for, it's called Compact Disc, it's the one, it's the, most of the blue bottom um, PS2 games that came out earlier, uh, 1999 to uh, like 2002 or three. Those are under 700 megabytes or MB. Those easily read on us. That's why that this is for. I'm gonna demonstrate on two videos. This video is gonna demonstrate Swap Magic CD version, and the game I'm gonna use is if you're a Super Nintendo freak like I am, it's a game called SNES Station. S N E S Station. It's basically as it says. It's a Super Nintendo for the PlayStation 2. Now, in order to play this, you need to go to SNES Station's website. Just Google SNES Station, it'll take you to the website. Download the program you need, but you also have to have Super Nintendo ROMs. If you don't know what that is, just Google that, and it'll tell you about it. Or watch another video on this. But basically, what you need to... In order to use Swap Magic in general, let me get this out the way, you need a working PS2. If you can see it there. It's right there. You need the Swap Magic CDs, as as always. You need a slide card. Now, a lot of people debate, should you make one or should you buy one? I made one because I'm a cheap motherfucker, so I can't afford it. But, you know what? I also got feedback on the ones you buy with the Swap Magic, and it doesn't work too good. Um, That's pretty much it on that. And also, right here, if you can see, it's a little too light, but I'm going to think, the tip of the logo, the black logo, matter of fact, give me one sec. There we go, it's a little brighter, but it ain't that bright. This is the PS2 disc tray logo frame. It's usually in the front. You gotta take that out because the slide card's gotta pull the tray out. Sounds rough, but it works. It's not gonna damage your system unless you make it damaged. Let's get started. I'm gonna put the CD version in. And let it load. It's gonna take a little bit. Browser menu. Alright. Also, the CD version, if it's in a scratched up condition, it tends to not read, period. Um, while I'm letting it low, I'm also explaining about the DVD version. The DVD version, I'm going to use two games. One's going to be a, a, a copy, and one's going to be an import. But you have to wait till the second video to watch that. This one's just going to be a C. Swap Magic. SwapMagic3.com if you want to go there. Now, this is where you come in. Slide card into the PS2. As soon as you feel it all the way to the left, you should be able to pull it all the way to the right and then outwards. And look, it still shows up. Nothing changed. This is the only way. You're tricking your lens on your PS2. Now you put in your copy of your SNES station, which I have right here SNES station yeah permanent marker shape put it in this time 
lot of people just close it tightly and try to, you know, use a sidecar to pull the lever back in place. I just give it a good slam, and it's better. Now you grab your controller, press X to load program, and if it loads successfully, it would do something like this. And believe me, man, playing the Super Nintendo on the damn PS2 is great. I have at least a couple thousand ROMs, so I never get fucked. I never get bored. Now, as for explanation, you're on your own, because like I said, you need your ROMs. Now, stay tuned to video two, where I explain and how to use the DVD version of Swap Magic. Peace.